Hi, I'm Dan, and welcome again to Dan Jumba. Now, I really love science, and I think science can be very magical. And、um, the one thing I like to do is that when I visit a science center, I love to watch their demonstrations or science shows. So today, I would be trying to do three simple science demonstrations、uh, on my own, and I think these are pretty magical. And、uh, perhaps you may want to try them at home too. So my first simple science demonstration,、uh, it's it's called fizzy potion. For all of you who love watching Harry Potter and you love to watch, and look at those、um, vials of、uh, smoldering, smoky potions, perhaps you might you might like this. Now I've never really tried this before, so I'm not sure how it will turn out.、Uh, so let's find out together. Okay. Now the things you will need,、uh, first of all, is、uh, sodium bicarbonate.、Um, This you can get in any shop that sells bakery supplies. You will need a lemon, okay?、Um, lime and oranges will do as well. And you need、uh, dishwashing liquid, okay? So we're gonna combine all this in in a certain order, and、uh, hopefully we will end up with a with a with a,、uh, a glass of fizzy、uh, potion. All right, so let's kick this off. First of all, I have my、uh, Sunday ice cream glass, which I'll place on this、uh, tray. So first, place、um, a little bit of your sodium bicarbonate into the glass. I'm not really sure how much to put in, so I'm gonna put in a liberal amount. Okay, I think I think that should work. Now, secondly, put in your dishwashing liquid, and I'm just gonna spread this all over it on top here. Okay,、uh, maybe a little bit more. Okay, and when I add in the lime juice, we shall see.、Uh, we should see、um, some fizz happening. So let me get my lime ready. Okay. Okay. So、uh, I'm going to add in the lime juice now, and let's see what happens. Okay, so、uh, let me let me stir this a little bit. And I'm gonna add in a bit more lime. Oh, lemon actually. So、uh, <laughs> I see a lot of fizz forming, but it's not really as exciting as I hope. Let me stir this a little bit and see what. Let's see if anything happens. Well, <laughs> I think that's about as fizzy as it gets. So、uh, it's kind of a letdown. Maybe I should have used a smaller glass, and then perhaps the, the fizz might just squirt all over. So. Experiment one was kind of disappointing.、Uh, well, there was fizz,、uh, and it was kind of fizzy, but it didn't kind of like、um, spill all over the cup as I thought it would. Anyways, let's move on to demonstration number two, and、uh, this is this I this I think you will like. So、uh, I have here,、um, okay, a piece of paper. All right. So can you see anything on the paper on both sides? No. Now let's see what happens when I spray my magic liquid. Can、okay, you see it? Okay, it's not too clear yet,、uh, but you cannot kind of see the words、uh, "magic of science." Now, let's try another one. Maybe this might be a bit clearer. So. Once again, some blank piece of paper. Now, if I were to spray it, yeah, it's way better. And you can see, then jumba. Okay, so what's this, what's how 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 do I get this done? It is、uh, not really an invisible ink, but it's something kind of similar. So first of all, you need、um, piece of paper, and you need a special ingredient, which is. 
turmeric. Now, thick turmeric, and then you can just have to draw it all over the paper. I'm going to do raw spirals here. And as you can see, you can't really see it because um, the turmeric leaves a very faint uh, yellow trace. And on the yellow paper, it, it's almost invisible. And what I'm going to spray with will be just um, a soap solution. And when I spray the soap solution on the paper, you can see the uh, color changes on the turmeric. So this is kind of cool, huh? So I hope you enjoyed uh, watching that. And uh, if you do try on your own, let me know how it goes. Perhaps you can send me a photo or uh, do a video of it. So thank you for watching and uh, take care.